Driving out now, we just did a major CrossFit workout, moving all of our stuff down four flights of stairs. After going to the Bronx at 6.30 this morning, renting out this truck and driving through the morning commuting traffic. First leg of our trip. Wow. Oh, this thing doesn't break down. It's like 150,000, 120,000 miles on it. September 30th, 2015. Today I expired. New York City Jenny expired. The countdown finally finished. My subway card used to always be a constant reminder that time was moving. Days ticking by, months, seasons changing. But today my card counted down days to the beginning. A new chapter, a life of no swipes, a count up of days remembered, sunsets enjoyed, and morning stretch. Juices made, time spent with loved ones and families. I can feel it. I am destined to do greatness, and now we are one step closer to it. One step closer to it. What is it? Will it be better? Worse? Different? Letting go of New York City is necessary for us to find it. To, to find it. To be it. As we were driving out of the city, I kept thinking of all the memories I had at every place we passed. The nights at the fancy restaurants and rooftop bars, the runs down the Hudson River while training for the New York City Marathon, and all the trips through the Lincoln Tunnel going to New Paltz or Harriman State Park to go rock climbing or hiking. Still hasn't hit me, but I think somewhere on the road trip it will. Somewhere in the middle of Arizona, it's really going to hit me that we don't live in New York City anymore. September 30th, 2015. I'm having strange feelings now because I'm not a New Yorker anymore. I have no home, no apartment, nothing except me, Jenny, and our freedom and time. October 1st, 2015. We were driving to Cleveland, and I was happy. I don't know why, but I was. Five hour drive, nothing to do but be, and I was happy. Perhaps because I spent all day with Adam. When we left, he gave his computer away to a friend, and he got emotional. He said, I've stared at you more than my wife over the last seven years. And perhaps that's why I'm happy. We traded in our monitors for time with each other. Where are we, Adam? We are less than an hour from my parents' house in Ohio. I spent about a five hour, five to six hour journey. We only stopped once to get a quiz note, so that was it. So it's been a good trip. Beautiful like sunset and fall foliage. And it's very nice. The only bad part is all the tolls we had to pay and this stupid knob here is broken, so I have to like grab it and crank the window open. But um, yeah, other than that, it's been a pretty easy trip. Yeah, I'm excited for another 30 hours on a road trip to Georgia and California.